His good friend Lance hit the hides, and Will played acoustic guitar to charm the ball pythons out of the wrap in the aquarium Lance had constructed. The delicacy of the day was pink-tailed white rat. The snakes copped a fork-tongued feel, but didn't roll the rats for the swallow, and Lance got dejected. He'd have to feed them egg. Rather than kill them, he would dye the rats with food coloring for a release into the woods. Camouflage. Should buy them some time to get their street smarts, Lance said. Poor things, Will replied, kicking at the dirt. They're nasty rodents, but I feel for them. First, they're caged, and then they're food. Now, food colored. Lance opened the brown paper bag and placed it on the ground. Two rats made their way cautiously out. Go to your mother, my little ones. Go to your doom, Will said. He thought of Raccoon, his cat, licking the white star in her cinnamon chest. Raccoon counts you in her sleep, you poor things, poor sniveling rodents. Raccoon's dream. Follow them, chase them, pursue them to the end of the earth. But do not cut down your dreams and stand over them, watching the blood escape, only to dry. Nothing left for you, Will told himself. You don't have to kill your dreams. We can go no direction the wind is not chosen, or time is not frozen. But dreams you cannot touch them. They touch you. Lance painted stills of his Glock on canvas and oil. He opened his palm one day for Will to see. Old bullets, he said. Want to have some fun? They went to the woods and loaded, then emptied the chambers, aiming for red squirrels on high branches in motion. Lance shot through a branch, and the squirrel leapt into the air and fell to a branch below. Will applauded. A good offense, your best defense, he thought, or something to that effect. Glock was serious heat in hand. He didn't remember what some people looked like, but that revolver, with its weight and cold to the touch, was calculated. Good, bad, beautiful and ugly. Lance smiled. I want to throw an exhibition, he said. When? Tonight. Will aimed at the squirrel, which was close now and still. The squirrel thought it was hidden. I've got this one, he said. Lance pushed his arm gently. Don't. You're too close. Will screwed up his eyes. That's what I'm trying for, you fool. Give it a chance. You don't want to kill a helpless animal. Yes, I do. That's why I'm here. This is a sport. There are rules you must observe. Observe this. The sport of killing furry animals. Fine, go ahead. You won't hit it. Squirrel's too smart for you anyway. Will aimed and sent a bullet into the tree. The squirrel flicked its tail. Aha! You were right. 